Hello guys, this is an invitation for a collaboration that I'll be hosting this season, April, flower, April Showers, May Flowers. My co-hosts are Shushana from Motin Shushana, Nita May, Kiki's from Kiki's DIY, and Tamara from Love My Babies Forever. Hi guys, Debbie here. Um, I just coming at you with this little video. I'm going to be redoing my tear tray. I'm going to be doing a little fairy garden. I'm going to bring you guys close. This is what I have done. I posted this yesterday, but I didn't like it. So I'm going to um, decorate my um, tear tray as a fairy garden. As you guys know, I did this um, DIY. So let's start taking everything out of the tray except the flowers. And I'm going to take my boosters out and let's do a fairy garden. So maybe I leave it, maybe by tomorrow, I'll show you guys a different video, how to decorate the tear tray. This is my kitchen glass table. We don't use this table. Nobody is eats in the kitchen. I usually use, use this table for uh, prepared foods and stuff. And yeah, so I'm gonna take everything out and I'm gonna come at you right back. Okay guys, I'm going to be using this little umbrellas. Also, these little chairs. And here I have the beach umbrella. And I have my little miniature fairy gardens. But then I also got some bigger fairy gardens that I have for like Wow, I think over 15 years. Um, I'm gonna get them, put them together, and then I show them to you guys. And I'm gonna show you how do I um, set everything up. Well, I have some flowers in this bag. And you guys can see it there. Then I have this that I had in my stash from the spring fling flower from the dollar tree it's been on my stash for a while and of course i'm going to use these flowers which is a garland that i drifted about maybe two weeks ago and then oh i'm going to use this green doily that i'm going to lay down here on top of the white um tray well it's not white it's beige and then these are the fairies that I have for over 15 years. Look at how beautiful they are. See the wings? They're so delicate. They like very, very delicate. So, and this one lost her wings over 10 years ago. And then this one too. And I must see if I DIY some. I have this put away for so many years. This, my daughter is 30 years old, 31 years old. And I have this when she was like eight years old. So it's been over basically 20 years actually. And then I have one more that they lost their wings. And I couldn't see myself throwing them away. So look at how beautiful they are, guys. Look at that face. And actually, I bought this. In, this right here was um, part of a lamp. I bought this in Puerto Rico when I went to visit my mom in 2002. So, yeah. So, yep, let's do a fairy garden, guys. So, the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to lay this here to cover some of the green. I mean, some of the tray. Yep. So I hope you guys are doing well. And guys, this is a reminder that for my collaboration, the possibilities are endless. You could do whatever you want. Just make sure you have like a little umbrella, a little bird, and some flowers. Yes, guys, come on over, join us. If you could do your fairy garden, if you like to do that, it doesn't have to be anything extravagant. 
You could do a table scape if you want. You could do anything, a DIY. You could do anything you want, guys. So, yep. Let me uh, accommodate the flowers and then I'm gonna come at you. Well, I accommodate my fairies. Let me bring you guys a little close. You guys can see what I did. So, yep, let me bring you guys down. So you guys can see. I don't know if you guys can see there, but then I'm gonna bring you closer. I put the little uh, in the back, in the little fairy garden that I did. So yeah, um, I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna put it right here next to it. And then I'm gonna come back here and put this closer over here. I put the big ones in the back. So yeah. And actually I'm gonna leave it right on the side. Um I was gonna use some of these blue ones, but I don't know where to put the blue ones. This guy doesn't go. So let me take some of these flower picks that I have here. Take them out. Cause I saved this for when I want to do something else. And let's accommodate some more flowers. So like that, it could have some more color over here in the front. Yeah, guys, remember the possibilities are endless. So you could do anything you want from my collaboration, a fairy garden, uh, decorate a tear tray, yeah. And if you don't have a bird, you could DIY a bird. So yeah, guys. And remember, I did this collaboration last year. This is not my first year doing it. And I am coming out with some more collaborations for the summer. And if you are interested in co-hosting with me, by all means, leave me a comment under the video. And yeah, we could do something. We could get together and do something. So guys, this is my little fairy garden. Um, let me um, show you. I mean, I have the little miniature bird there, but I want to put a bigger bird here, not a rooster. So let me go get my little birds. I'll be right back, guys. Well, guys, I got my birds. Remember, I drifted, I drifted these. This one and this one, they came in a bag. So yeah, look at how beautiful they look. Guys, and if you don't have a bird, you have a rooster or an owl, I think I could consider that a bird. That's a bird, so yeah. So guys, I'm gonna put this little babies right here because since they're almost the same size of the fairies, so I'm gonna put them right here. One is looking at the fairy sleeping because they are sleeping right now. I said um, these two are taking a break. They're sleeping, they're tired. And this one, they are watering the flowers and this one is working also in the flowers. And in the back, the little mini miniature ones. And remember, they are all related. All fairies are related. Um, this one in the back is sitting on the chair reading a book and this one right here is feeding the little uh, deer that's laying down and this one she didn't want to lay down and take a break so she's just sitting on her chair and she just contemplating a rose that she got in her hand yeah guys this is my little fairy garden i hope you guys like it i enjoy doing it let me bring you guys from the top and show you let me take you guys out of here sorry about that and this is what it looks like my little fairy garden i hope you guys like it i enjoy putting it together for you guys so here we go from the top yep i enjoy doing this for you guys and remember be kind to one another don't forget to smile
stay safe, and overall, be kind. Be kind, because being kind, it does cost you anything. And stay safe, stay blessed, and it will be into the next one. Bye, guys.